Lucas Hademan here. Welcome to this week's episode of Guitar Tone Tuesday, which is all about stainless steel frets. And I want to dispel a couple of myths which I have seen online about these frets. In fact, even on YouTube, I find that there's not really a clear answer about these frets. And, and if you're someone who maybe is having a new guitar made, or if you've got a number one guitar, um, and you're thinking about perhaps putting stainless steel frets in that instrument, uh, I just wanted to talk to you guys about a couple of things that I think, uh, personally, are very, very positive points about stainless steel frets. Um, first of all, let's talk about the myths. People say that these frets kill your strings. Uh, in my opinion, as a gigging musician, no, they don't. Um, it, probably unless you use like a pure nickel string, you know, that's maybe when the frets will actually destroy your strings. Um, basically the whole rule of thumb with frets is that you don't want a material that is significantly harder than your strings or vice versa. If you have a string that is significantly harder, uh, harder alloy than, than your frets, then you're going to kill your frets, right? So that's why uh, often people say, you know, pure nickel strings are great with nickel silver frets. But uh, with stainless steel frets, I mean, I've been using D'Addario NYXLs with this guitar since I've had it for about a year now. And I can keep the same set of strings on my guitar for about four months, which is normal for me on any guitar. Um, you know, the nice thing about these frets is that bending is so easy, you know. Um, for instance, like, I, I can go up here on the B string or the high E string and just, you know, really go for those crazy bends. Uh, I mean, I could even go for, like, those David Gilmore style bends, you know. And these are 11 gauge strings that I'm playing on this on this guitar, you know, so you can really go crazy with bands. And the, and the string doesn't get caught up on the fret. That's the thing. You know, uh, another amazing fact about these frets is that um, I've had this guitar for over a year now and there is no fret wear on the fretboard at all. Um, I've been playing the, this guitar a lot. In fact, I've been using it for teaching uh, as well as gigging a fair, fair bit. And man, these frets, uh, Jess Carr stainless steel, are just amazing. Um, so that's the biggest thing is that people say, oh yeah, it's going to kill your uh, kill your strings. No, not in my opinion, no. Uh, the other thing that people say is that, that your guitar is overly bright. Now, if we listen to this guitar unplugged... It has lots of life and resonance, but it doesn't sound overly bright to me, you know. And once you get into a mix with a band, if there is an extra bit of top end there, you're not going to hear it, you know. So uh, I just love these frets. They're really, really smooth. Uh, let me uh, pick up a flat pick and play for you guys a little bit with a, with a pick here, just so you can hear uh, how they sound. 
with some overdrive. <laughs> sustain if i did this on nickel silver frets which i do <laughs> um for a year i would have dead frets um but i don't you know uh, if you're someone who plays a lot of guitar if, if you have an instrument that you want to play a lot i personally think that the naysayers are just manufacturers who are saying oh it eats up tools and all that kind of stuff yeah, I mean, sure it does because these frets are harder, but once you get them in your guitar, you're probably never going to have to take them out. You know, that that's the biggest thing. And, you know, I just love playing on frets that always feel like the guitar is brand new. It's it's an amazing thing. I mean, that's the, the feeling that we all want, right? I mean, I think it's just great. You know, you can even bend your low strings. With no resistance, and it's just an amazing thing, you know. That's my D string, and I'm bending it up a minor third. The guitar's still in tune, feels awesome. So anyways, I just wanted to open up the comment section below to let uh, me know what do you guys think of stainless steel frets? Have you tried them on a guitar and did you like them as much as I do? Uh, I give it a thumbs up. In fact, two thumbs up uh, for these stainless steel frets. Again, these are just car stainless steel. That's what uh, the late, great Gerard Melanson was using on his guitars. And oh, just the smoothest, butteriest, you know, butteriest is not a word. The most buttery, smooth feeling I've ever felt on a guitar. Uh, that's about it for this week. Please do like, share, subscribe, comment, uh, and ring that bell. We'll see you guys and girls again next Tuesday.